boy at this point. This is just onslaught. This is anal. There's another person. There. Oh, I missed a lot of bullets. How the fuck this No, I'm gonna, I'm leaving. I. That's what I get for using FAL. Yo guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another model for video for y'all today, man. So I've been getting a lot of comments from you guys wondering what are my top five favorite class setups in Modern Warfare or basically the top five best weapons in this game, man. Just clarifying right now, this is not for Warzone. They're not loadouts. They're strictly for multiplayer more for search and destroy, but usually just for multiplayer overall. Man, if you are new to the channel, we just did hit a thousand subscribers, so please go down below and hit that sub button. If you do enjoy the video, hit that thumbs up, guys. Without further ado, let's go check out the top five class setups and weapons. So, starting off with number five, we do have the AUG. Man, so usually just base this weapon, just the base weapon, isn't too great, but with this class setup, in my opinion, it's probably the fifth best gun right now in Modern Warfare. Because with the NATO rounds, actually, it makes it the fastest time to kill automatic weapon in the entire game, believe it or not. What I run on this gun, I use a 407 millimeter extended barrel with a Forge Tac CQB comb stock, stipple grip tape. The NATO rounds are basically a must with this gun, then the Merc 4 grip, man. Definitely an all around super good gun. The reason why it's at five is because it's super powerful. But at probably medium to far range, the, guns, the gun gets extremely bouncy and hard to hit people. So that's why I have it at five. Moving on to number four, we do have the M13. The M13 is an absolute unit of a weapon. As most of you guys know, this thing is a laser beam. From really any range, it destroys people. But the thing that reason why it's number four and not higher up on the list is because the damage output isn't too strong. For this gun, I do run the Tempest Marksman Barrel, the biggest barrel on the weapon. Commando foregrip, 50 round mags. The reason I run 50 round mags is because it has such a high fire rate. You run out of ammo super quick, man. I use simple grip tape and then the GI Mini Reflex just kind of help my aim and stuff. But if you don't want to use a GI Mini Reflex, you can always throw on the Monolith Suppressor or like a No Stock or something like that, man. On to number three, we do have the MP5. I know I would get absolutely torched in the comments if I didn't have this gun on here. So we do have the MP5, man. The class setup I do run on this weapon. For muzzle, I use a compensator, the Merc foregrip for the underbarrel, the ammunition. I still do use the 30 round 10 millimeter mags. I just always think those are better. For Warzone, I know a lot of people like the 45 round mags, but just in multiplayer, I, I just stick with the 30 round. Um, the rear grip, I use simple grip tape for the ADS speed, and then I use the FTAC collapsible stock for the ADS speed as well, man. As most of you know, the MP5 has always been a dominant gun in Modern Warfare, literally since the beginning. They've had a lot, a lot of nerfs to it, and I still think it's a really good weapon, so that's why it's in the number three slot. So moving on to the number two spot, obviously we do have to have the M4A1, man. The gun, as everyone knows, is an all-around beast of a weapon. Always has been the COD League, multiplayer, and even Warzone, dude. This gun's insane. So what I run on this gun, for the muzzle, I use Compensator to control the recoil a little more. For the barrel, I use a Corvus Custom Marksman. Super good all-around barrel. Commando foregrip, just kind of kick... Bleh. Just kind of keep that ADS speed, but with a little recoil control. Dipple grip tape for the rear grip, obviously for the ADS speed. And then for the stock, I actually do use the Forge Tac CQS for the ADS speed. I do not use the no stock stock attachment anymore because they did nerf it actually, and it's not as good as it used to be. And finally, man, we are to the number one gun. No surprise, probably for a lot of you guys, it is the FAL, man. This gun's probably going to get a nerf when season five comes around, so I wouldn't be surprised if it wasn't on the list here soon. But for right now, it is the number one gun. I mean, it's, it's the best gun in Warzone. It's the best gun in multiplayer. It's the best gun all around that Call of Duty's seen, probably besides the 725 right off the start. But... What I run on this gun to make it just even that much better than it already is. For the barrel, I use the XRK Marksman. For the stock, I use the no stock stock attachment just for the movement and ADS speed. And then for the rear grip, I use stipple grip tape. Under barrel, I use a Merc foregrip just to kind of control that recoil. And not a lot of people like using FMJ, which I totally get. I like FMJ because I like wall banging people, you know, just for fun. But if you guys want to throw that, take that off and throw on like a monolith suppressor or a sight or ammunition, really whatever you want. But those four base attachments are is what gonna 
bring this FAL to a whole nother level, guys. So that is the top five guns, in my opinion, with the class setups along with them. I hope you guys do enjoy it, man. I think you have a lot of fun using those weapons for sure, because I know I do. But now I'm going to be showing you a search and destroy match where I use the FAL, because I'm just going to be using the number one gun, obviously, just for the video's sake, because people probably want to see it in action. Um, yeah, we absolutely fry this game. You'll see it on me when you watch it. And this gun is broken. Hopefully, talking to you, freaking Infinity Ward, hopefully you guys nerf this weapon because it's unbelievable right now. It's almost unfun to play against. But I'll do it for you guys. I hope you guys do enjoy the video. And thank you for stopping by. Man, good, man. Just chilling. Having fun all day. Not really, bro. I was just chilling all day. What? Oh, I'm about to jump shot this dude. Oh. Fuck, he heard me. Dude, I can't sprint with this goddamn controller. I just chucked oh, the C4 cool. on top of the house. Uh, it's unfortunate timing. Oh, I fucking vaulted over the. Damn it. Back. So you can't wall bang anything in this map. <laughs> hey, me too. They're dead. They dead. Dead and gone, dead and gone, dead and over. I've been trying on this road too long. <gasps> oh my Dude. gosh, bro. Oh my. Oh! Holy shit, dude. <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh, Sorry. It's that 16 and 2 joint. <laughs>